Hey guys, welcome back to another video today, and there's gonna be two vehicles that will be retired, and you probably did not even expect any of this. Not only are they gonna become retired, they're also become limited as well, and yes, you won't be able to get them after this update. There also is gonna be a revamped robbery from a robbery you probably didn't even expect as well, so there's a lot of unexpected stuff this update, so before we jump right into it, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe because it really helps me a lot. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump right in. So the first vehicle is right over here, the Airtail. Yes, you might be very confused why it's gonna be the Airtail, what I'll explain later on because a Simo basically explains why but yes the Airtel has been only released since like last year like I think it was like March 2021 when this vehicle came out um, but yeah the Airtel is gonna be removed the next vehicle that's gonna be removed is actually at the museum so let's go ahead and head over there all right so here we are at the museum we're right over here and ooh, nice flip anyway the car is the classic car yes this is gonna be removed and it's actually quite a decent vehicle for its price 50k for a pretty nice this is also a really good off-road vehicle by the way and uh, it's pretty good for escaping the museum so yes this will be removed in the next update not removed but retired and then the car becomes limited but you can still spawn the car if you guys know what retired cars are you can still spawn the car in the garage so you can still use them but no more people can buy them anymore so here's the tweet where Bedemo talks about the Airtel and the classic car over here they say this is your last chance to grab the classic or Airtel in jailbreak last day is this Friday January 7th Owners keep these vehicles forever. So, yes, as you can see over here, last chance to buy January 7th, 2022. The Airtel 600,000 and the Classic for 50,000. So, I would highly recommend the Classic because, you know, it's the cheapest, also a pretty decent vehicle. The Airtel, I think, like, honestly, like, it's a good car to own, but if you already have the Roadster, like, it's kind of similar to the Roadster. So, yeah, I mean, it's not really necessary, but you should go ahead and buy. It's a pretty nice looking vehicle. So I know some of you might be like pretty sad that these vehicles are going away, but I'm actually quite happy because of they're going to be limited cars. And you know why I'm happy about that is because trading is coming this year in 2022. And that means that, you know, if you have a limited vehicle, that means it, it's a rare vehicle to own. And people may trade you for that. They might overpay you. They might trade you a little bit more than you're supposed to get. So actually owning these limited cars may help you in the long run. So if you do have the 650000 cash. I recommend buying these two vehicles because you can own a limited vehicle, which might help you in trading. Trading is really going to be so good for jailbreak. I'm just saying, man, like I could finally get other vehicles. Well, I actually own all the vehicles. Well, I actually need some um, vehicle customizations, you know, all the cosmetics. I don't own all of that, so I could probably trade up and get those. So, yeah. Anyway, you might be thinking, what the next thing they're going to revamp? What's the next robbery? Like, what is it? It? Well, it's actually the museum, and it's kind of obvious because, you know, the classic car is right next to the museum, so once people saw they're going to be removing the classic car, they're just like, oh yeah, it, it gotta be the uh, revamp for the museum robbery. And you guys were right if you guessed that, I guess. So, as you can see over here, Badimo says, we're revamping the museum. All new look and bigger building, randomized puzzles, and even more items to steal releases this Friday on hashtag Roblox Jailbreak. And if you take a look, it is completely different. There's a chandelier on top. The planets are different. It's like more spaced out and open. And you know that... I think that's like a gem back there. Like, I think that's new. There wasn't that right there. And then, you know, th there's an egg. There's like more stuff to rob too. And there's the upstairs here. And there's also an upstairs going all the way up here. So there's like two places. Uh, well, that's in jailbreak anyway. But I think this is like, this is new down here. Like, this is like, maybe there's like a basement. I don't know, man. Because like, there's steps going down. So that might be a basement. I, we'll, we'll never know, all right? However, Simo did share an outside look of the museum, and as you can see, this is what it looks like. Even the parking lot got refreshed, and yeah, there's no more classic car. I mean, there's no more classic car right there, but as you can see, it is a lot bigger. And the exit isn't like right here anymore, it's like right to the side, so you're just going out that way. And I, I believe that the other side should be the same thing, I mean, to make it parallel, I mean, it should look like that. I mean, I don't know, man, but um, yeah. 
I also noticed there's like a lot more windows. Yeah, like before the museum didn't have a lot of windows, and like I don't think museums should even have that many windows. I mean, they're, they're displaying like art and stuff, so you don't really need that many windows. Well, maybe you do, but it looks a lot nicer of those windows now. And you can also see the dynamite up there, as you can see right up there. I can see that on the roof. Now here's where Asimo actually answers the question about the classic car. Like, is anyone going to actually replace it? And Asimo says, not at this time. There's actually a good question that Model asks. He says, like, confusing to see the Airtel being retired. It was added not even a year ago. As you guys do know, it was added, like, way back in, like, March 2021. And that was, like, less than a year ago. Well, it's, like, 10 months ago. So it's not that long ago. And usually, like, retired vehicles are, like, a few years old. So we can add new vehicles. So this one's less than a year old. So this is, like, the newest retiring vehicle, which is quite odd. But it seemed like I actually replied over here saying too many uh, supercars and cars in general. Concept is now more valuable. So... Or maybe he's talking about the car itself, yeah, but he. But the mo main reason why, number three is the most important, he was never happy, Asimo was never happy with this Blender model, so he made the Airtail and didn't really like it, but still published it anyway, so he doesn't really like it, so he's going to take it out, so maybe that means we'll have a cooler supercar coming out, or maybe other cooler vehicles, because you know, when you remove cars, there's going to be probably new cars, which is good. But yeah, tell me what you guys think about the cars being removed from Jailbreak. Like, you know, to be honest, like the Airtail, I'm not really that upset with it getting removed. Some people are like upset with it. And like, you know, the Roadster's here, it's pretty much the same as the Roadster, same price. And, uh, you know, just same thing. So if you couldn't get the Airtel, you still got the Roadster. So you're not missing out on that much. I mean, the Roadster is insane with acceleration. Um, but the Airtel is actually a little bit faster than the Roadster, however. But, I mean, I, I think the Roadster is honestly better because, you know, it has faster acceleration. Uh, but the Volt Bike actually is the fastest, but I still like, like the Roadster a lot. So I think the Roadster is a pretty good fit. With the classic car, honestly, like, I, that, that's been there for, like, a few years already. So, I also haven't seen anyone use that car. Like, just be honest. Like, you have not seen anyone use that vehicle. Most likely because, you know, it's a, it's a classic car. And there's probably better classic cars out there than that old Bugatti model. So, you know. Hopefully, Simo adds more classic cars. Because I'll actually like to see that. You know, just, you know, old classics and stuff. Added in Jailbreak. That will be pretty nice to have. You know, those old muscle cars. I think that would be pretty cool to have in Jailbreak. Anyway, tell me what you guys think down below. And, uh, yeah, we catch you guys more for more Jailbreak update news. And I'll see y'all later. Whoa, that was, <laughs> that was an actually really good, perfectly timed flip. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see y'all later. Bye!